Uh, pretty scrolly SVG animation. So the, if you've seen this page on our site, this is the mobile page where we talk about how good our apps are. And there's this pretty scrolly animation here. As you scroll, it kind of draws these images of a phone and then of a watch and then of some money. So I'm gonna go do a quick live demo of how to create a pretty scrolly SVG animation. Uh, and it all comes down to, as you, I'm sure you all guessed, CSS, right? The solution to everything is CSS. There's just two, two CSS properties we have to, to know about in order to impl implement one of these. And those are dash uh, stroke dash array. Um, actually, I'm gonna have it myself. So I have here, I created this, this uh, illustration, which is the neighbor logo. Um, but the thing that makes it unique is it's a single line. So there's one line that's drawn throughout here that I made that is the entire logo. And you can see here on the left, this is the code that created that line. This is, this is an SVG, right? So an SVG, uh, it kind of defines how you create this line. The, the key here is because it's a line, I can say, I wanna make this line a dashed line. And this property stroke dash array, that will uh, say, I want dashes that are this size. So as I increase the size, those dashes get bigger. I can decrease it. The other property we want is stroke dash offset, which basically just says I want to offset the dashes by this much. So as I change this property, you can see those dashes are slowly moving along. So it's kind of like the, the key to this whole thing. So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna find out the length of this line um, just by increasing the dash array until we have a single dash that is the size of the whole uh, line. And this is a pretty big image I created. I should have made it a little smaller, but uh, okay, there's that. Okay, and then we're going to animate the the offset backwards so that it uh, the whole thing basically just disappears. And I'm just going to say this time negative fourteen nine sixty pixels. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm a pixel off. That's okay. And then I'm going to throw in this fancy code. I've got two minutes. Oh man, I've copied too many things recently. Here we go. And basically, I'm going to take the path, and then every 100 milliseconds, I'm going to de decrease the dash array offset by 100 pixels. And what that will do is it will make it look like it's drawing when it's really just moving that dash along, along the path. And so I'll just go through the, the whole thing and when it gets to the end, it'll kind of start backwards and the white will eat up the, the uh, logo along the path. And yeah, that's basically it. And then from here, what I did here is just, as you scroll, it uh, animates or changes those two properties accordingly. So that's it. Very cool.